the last class, which started almost a month ago, and we did with all topics related to heart of algebra. We did with the graphing as well. So today I would like to start with the passport for advanced math topic. So passport advanced math is very simple that you have learned your schooling, all the basic rules of math will be seen here. This is another very big chapter, a big module for SAT math. Very, very big module. There are subtopics of nearly eight to nine. Good evening, Abhishek. Good evening, Ashishwani. Very good evening, everyone. Let me start. So please put the heading as uh, uh, passport to advanced math. Passport to advanced math. In this, the first chapter is what? Radical and rational exponents. Radical and rational exponents, right? So here we will see some basics first. So guys, if basics are the basis are same in the product, then we can add the powers, right? X power m into x power n is x power m plus n, right? What is x power m whole power n? X power n whole power m is it x power m into n? Isn't it? What is x power m over x power n? Is it x power m minus n? What is anything power 0? Anything power 0 is equal to 1 now. And we know that what is root x into root y, nth root x into nth root y? This is nth root of x into y. What is nth root x over nth root y? nth root x over nth root y is it nth root x by y so we will use these basic while solving the questions guys so if you are done say yes please copy these rules so they seems to be very easy but trust me there will be one or two questions on this module on this topic so somebody please acknowledge by saying yes in the QA box I will go for the numericals now Yeah, Vishik Srija, let's go to question. So in the left side expression, this is b power 3 into b power 4 whole power 2 is b power 8, right? This is b power x. When the bases are same in the product, the powers can be added. So b power 11 equal to b power x. Bases are same, powers are same, right? What is the value of x? 11. 11 means option b. A simple question to start with. Second question. So 1 by 2 means 2 power minus 1. Whole power minus 2 plus 3 power 0. So 2 power minus 1 whole power minus 2 is 2 power 2, that is 4. 3 power 0 is 1. So 4 plus 1, 5. So 5 means option D, right? I got majority wrong answer this time. So please be careful, guys. Please be careful. Next question. So this is a cube root, right? So cube root of, can I write 24 as 8 into 3? b power 3 into, can I write w power 8 as w power 6 into w power 2? What is the process to solve? So try to write to the powers of 3 so that the cube root and the cube will get cancelled. That's the motto. So this is cube root of three separately, this w square separately. 
3 double square into 8 is 2 cube b cube b double b cube double e power 6 means the double e power 2 whole cube right double e power 6 can be written as double e power 2 whole power 3 now this cube root will not cancel for 3 double e square that will remain the same so cube root 3 double e square this cube root cube gets cancelled cube will come out of the cube b will come out of the cube and double e square come out of the cube so 2v double e square into cube root 3 double e square that is option c right so they have actually we finished one quarter syllabus we are doing the next quarter and the topic is passport to advanced math you can continue from here nothing to worry now the next question Yeah, Jaydi, nothing to worry, ma'am. Just focus. So this is two into three root four. Three root four means four power one by three, right? Two into three root two means two power one by three. So two into two is four. Four means a two square, four power one by three. This is two power one by three. This is 4 into 2 power 2 by 3 into 2 power 1 by 3. 4 into if the bases are same, powers can be added, right? 2 by 3 plus 1 by 3, 3 by 3, 3 by 3 means 1, so 2 power 1. So 4 to the 8 is answer. So generally, these kind of questions. Shukumar, there is only SAT math. This is SAT math class. We don't do reasoning here, we'll do only math. You can do that also, guys. As actually, I told you one more rule now. In the introduction, I told you one rule. So here, 2 into 2, 4. Cube root 4 into cube root 2 is cube root 8. So cube root 8 means 2. Because 2 cube is 8 now. 3 cube gets cancelled, 4 to the 8. You can do that also. It's all up to you guys. Next question. So, when you have negative powers, the best thing is inverse the fraction and remove the negative sign and the power. So B 64 by B power 27 whole power minus 2 by 3 means B power 27 by 64 whole power positive 2 by 3. Then this is B power 27 whole power 2 by 3 by 64 means 4 cube, right? 4 cube whole power 2 by 3. You can split the power to numerator denominator, no? So 3 goes 9 times in this, 9 to the 18. So this is B power 18. 3, 3 cancel. 4 square. 4 square is 16. So B power 18 by 16. Where is B power 18 by 16? Option B, B for Bombay. Yes. Next question. So what you have to do? Three plus four root five, sorry, three plus root five into four minus root five equal to a plus b root five. What is the sum of values of a and b if a and b are integers? Three fourth of twelve. Three into minus root five minus three root five. Root five into four is four root five. Plus into minus five root five into root five is five. This is a plus b into root five, right? 12 minus 4 is 7. This is 4 root 5. This is equal to a plus b root 5. Now compare like terms. Compare the like terms and the get their coefficients. And compare the like terms and the coefficients. A is constant term. Here a is 7. B is a root 5 coefficient, which is 1. Sorry. So 4 root 5 minus 3 root 5 is 1 root 5, right? 
Now, what is 7 plus 1? 8 is answer. Next question. So, this is root 8 into root 8 means the root over 4 into 2 is 8 now. This is 2 root 2 plus 8. Root 4 is 2 into root 2. So root 8 is 2 root 2 into 2 root 2 plus 8. So 2 root 2 into 2 root 2, you have to write as a first term. And then 2 root 2 into 8 as a second term. 2 into 2, 4. Root 2 into root 2, 2. 4 to the 8. 8 to the 16 plus 16 into root 2. So this is 8 plus 60 and root 2. Nikita, in the previous question, that is 4 root 5 minus 3 root 5, Nikita. So 8 plus 16 root 2 is correct, guys. Option C. Next question. So here a power 3 whole power 3 is a power 9 into a power 9 minus 9. If bases are same, powers are equal, powers are added. So powers are added means anything power 0, 1, right? Such an easy question now. Next question. So what is the answer, guys? When the bases are same, you can add the powers, right? Minus 1 by 2 plus 7 by 6. 8 power take calcium, 6, 2 goes 3 times, right? So 3 into minus 1, minus 3. 6 goes 1 times 7. So 8 is uh, as this. This is 3 by 6, no? Sorry, 4 by 6 means uh, 2 by 3. 8 power 2 by 3. So 8 means 2 cube. 2 keep whole power 2 by 3. So 3, 3 cancel. So 2 square means 4. So 4 is right answer, guys. So I think the majority answers are wrong this time. Only single digit people send the answer, right answer for this. Yeah, by four. Next question. Question seems to be very simple and awkward sometimes, but uh, they can be SAT questions, right? So three by root five, right? So 3 by root 5. Let us multiply numerator and denominator with 5. Root 5 goes root times in this. That is 3 root 5 by 5. Option A. Yeah, this time it has it is a question, easy question. I got all answers right. Only two people send, send them wrong. Okay, next question. 